In this video, we're going to look at how we're going to add text to Canva. So I've come into my little infographic here and I go down to the text button and you see I've got three levels of text and you want to stick with those kind of three levels. So this is where you do most of your writing. These are your little subheadings, that's your main heading. So I'm going to start with the main heading. I'm going to bring it in over here. Just click on it and I'm going to now type in there what I want it to be. The five highest peaks in the the world okay so now I've got my text in here there's some things I can do so if I click on it I can move it around you notice down here I can actually tilt it if I want either way it tells me degrees I'm tilting it using that handle down there here I can change my font I can click and choose a different font if I want so let's see if I can find a different font that I might want to use how about that one that looks good five highest peaks in the world Rightio, I can also change the size, so I can make it larger, there, that looks good, or smaller, I can change the font colour, so this one I might make into that dark blue, so it kind of matches with my scheme, Rightio, the five highest peaks in the world, and then you've got different effects you can actually do here, so you can actually do things like the splice, or um, have no effects, or have a bit of a lift, so it's got a bit of a shadow behind it, you can make them hollow and, and you have a shadow effect and you see even here you've got the different settings you can do below it so I can make the offsets of the shadows further away and I can change the direction of that shadow so have a play around with your different effects and see what you want to do for each of them right now I've done that I'm now going to put my subheading in and the subheading is going to be down for each one of these little tabs so I'm going to move you using the handle here I'm going to place them in the middle there and I'm going to drag this across so it's up against the edge of that there. Um, I'm going to make the subheading. Let's can play around with that. Thank you. I'm going to make him a bit bigger. And I'm going to go and use the same that I was using for Langan. Right here, I'm going to use the same color that I just had before. And I'm also going to drag this up so it's in line with the top up there. And my subheading is going to be Mount Everest. Radio, and um, I might want to make you a little bit, I want to make you an overall font size. Let's choose one of 42. How's that? There, awesome. So I've got Mount Everest over here, and that's been put into that box there. Last one, I'm going to put my, my text body in here, and I've got some text that I've saved over here that saves you watching me having to type this in. So I'm coming in, and with like with all the other stuff, I can change the box shape and size oh, yeah, I've got that here that's probably a little bit too big let's make that down the next line thank you make the text a little smaller um, I'm going to do the alignment which is here and I'm, you can just cycle through different types of alignment so center left justified and right so I'm going to make mine left just best I'm going to make it bold because it's a little bit hard to see actually I'll select the entire text to make it bold thank you bold uh, they kind of backfired because it's made it all big. So let's turn it off bold um, and change that color and make it the same color here. So there we are. I now have my text in there. So that's how you go about adding text to Canva.